A small plane crashed onto Interstate 85 near the Davidson County Airport, hit a tractor trailer, and burst into flames, killing that pilot. Yeah, tonight we know that the driver of that tractor trailer is in the hospital with non life threatening injuries. Our Jordan Brown has details about exactly what happened. While crews worked through the night to clean up the debris left behind by a plane crash on a busy highway on a Wednesday afternoon, the FAA now has to figure out what caused the plane to go down so quickly after taking off. A busy highway shut down until further notice after a fiery plane crash killed at least one person. There was a small plane that was taken off from the Lexington Airport and at some point in time descended and collided in the rear of a tractor trailer that was in motion traveling south on I-85 at the 88 mile marker. Debris from the tractor trailer and the twin engine Beechcraft Baron that hit it now cover a portion of the I-85 southbound lane. The crash site is just a few hundred feet from the Davidson County Airport. From my understanding, the aircraft was taken off from the airport, not landing. As soon as it came down onto the interstate, the plane was engulfed in flames. The tractor trailer it hit overturned on the side of the road. Troopers say the pilot, who is not being identified at this time, died at the scene. The driver of the tractor trailer survived. The operator of the tractor trailer was transported to Lexington Memorial Hospital with minor injuries. The FAA will have to determine the cause of the crash, which could take several days. Now again, the pilot that died is not being identified at this time. The FAA and the NTSB will be leading this investigation. In Davidson County, I'm Jordan Brown.